The value of volunteering has given me a purpose in life because I wasn't able to carry on working. It makes me feel useful instead of me having an illness. I'm fighting the illness through research and it's to a very, very worthwhile cause. You know, OCD cost me children and anything I'm contributing hopefully to the children of tomorrow. Hi, I'm Lynn Drummond. I'm a consultant psychiatrist and I've been working in the area of OCD research and treatment for almost 40 years now. I'm here today to tell you about the opportunity of joining the new Orchard OCD Registry. The Orchard OCD Registry is a national database which will bring together researchers and people living with OCD to drive forward research. As that is fascinating, you learn. And the thing I will stress is nobody makes you say or do anything in research that you don't want to do. And you do come out of it feeling a lot, lot better because you get access to some of the best brains in the business, for want of a better word. You know, you learn about yourself and it's therapeutic. There is exciting new research going on at the moment, some of which is funded by Orchard. Examples of the new research include looking at the potential role of exercise in OCD, neuroimaging, the role of inflammation in OCD, new medications and new psychological treatments. It's really simple and easy to sign up to the OCD registry. All you need to do is go online to orchardocdregistry.org Org. You'll then be asked a few simple questions and also your preferences. If research comes in in the area that you're interested in, you will receive either a text, an email or a phone call, depending on what you've said you would prefer to do. Once that happens, you are under no obligation to take part and you can, of course, opt not to take part or withdraw at any point. Thank you for listening and I do hope you decide to join the OCD registry and that will make you part of the OCD research community. It really is important as together we can really push back against OCD and improve the lot of people living with this often devastating condition. Thank you.